Did you know that the Ghetto statue came from the moon? The same moon which was created by Hagoromo and Hamura when they sealed their mother. Ghetto statue is basically a husk of the Ten Tails, and the Ten Tails was the incarnation of the God Tree, which Kaguya planted. The Ghetto statue can only be summoned by Rinnegan, so it stayed inside the moon for almost a thousand years. But once Madara awakened the Rinnegan, he broke the seal and summoned the statue down to Earth. Hagoromo divided the Ten Tails into nine different beasts, so Akatsuki were actually putting the tailed beast's chakra back into the Ghetto statue. Now, this is interesting. If you are not a Jinchuriki and you try to summon the statue with the Rinnegan, it will suck up all your life force, just like Nagato's. He didn't know he could summon the Gato statue. So, when Yahiko killed himself on Nagato's kunai, Nagato unintentionally summoned the Gato statue in his rage. But that drained all the life force out of Nagato and pierced his back with black rods. Yet he was still able to survive. A perk you get by being Uzumaki. A shinobi with both Senju and Uchiha chakra like Obito can control it even without Rinnegan.